Today we're gonna cheer loud, jump high, and look pretty. The A Squad. Cheerleaders kick! So where's your Snickers today? <laughs> your ice cream, you don't have it. Are you sick of it? But next to wearing the prosthetic belly, pregnancy belly, <laughs> that was probably the most challenging because we'd have to do take after take. And you know, I'll confess I'm a chocoholic, so the at first the idea sounded great, you know, oh great, I get to eat Snickers all day. No. Bad, bad scene. Especially when I had to dip it in ice cream. Ugh. It was just terrible. So Marla, <laughs> yes. You're bitter, bitter, bitter. Bitter. Girl. All the time. Yeah. Bitter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a bitter girl. <laughs> Were you, were you channeling anything, you know, for that? Was there <laughs> anyone you envied? Um, not to the extent that, you know, grade school, like you... I just thought it was funny. Little Marla. <laughs> I've been jealous and envious of people, of course. You know, who has not I'd be lying if I said I didn't, you know? <laughs> now you... You get to be, you know, the bad, <laughs> bad girl. It was really hard. I had to study for months and months. It was just Please. Like, <laughs> Please. I mean, you see how she's like, just who is this person? Me right how can now? she be like that? There's just something wrong, you know? Right. Mm -hmm. now, so good hearted, spiritual. Now, is there anyone that you have known that's similar to the character that you played? Well, yeah. I think that Diane kind of represents, you know, the American princess at large. She's sort of the umbrella of all, you know, what we think of when we think of the cheerleader, you know, the American cheerleader. I think Lucy, I mean, you know, she's, you know, she's got the cute little Sandra D thing going on, <laughs> with little bangs and a little bouffant ponytail. Um, and she's ambitious. I mean, cheerleading is clearly something that she wants to have, you know, on her resume. And not only that, she loves these girls. They're like her sisters, you know? Okay. <laughs> She's a really good friend. Um, she's also, honestly, one of the smartest people I know. Oh, I grew up no, no, no. No, wow. really. She's very, very smart. Like, she, she has a lot of knowledge about numerous things. You know, she's really? really big on, like, I so don't the, feel that way. You, know, you always are watching, like, The Learning Channel. Oh, and yeah, it's reading your um, National Geographic. We were really, really lucky, I think, because yeah. we all got along really well. And I think that's probably rare. Wow. Yeah, you never know what's yeah. going to happen when you get a bunch of girls together, but we all had such distinct personalities and no ego, and we all got along perfect. Everyone was up for anything. God, Marla. You guys nice. <laughs> just totally pumped your brain, you know? I love Marla. Marla and I have known each other for a long time, and she's a lot like me. Like, the side that I have to me is being so sassy and, like, Sarcastic. spunky. Yeah, like, I totally find that in her. We just, just have so much fun. Sugar and salt.